Steve, Nokia, that's talking about you. You have the opportunity to stripe across all these different agencies and, quite frankly, the private sector as well. Give us a, uh, an example, if you would, that you'd like to highlight a program where you've been able to bring this technology in and perhaps reimagine a, an environment. Yeah, well, I, I, you know, there's, I can think of several, so I'll try to keep this uh, focused. Try, um, try to get it crisp on one. We're trying to pack okay, it all so in here. I, I think a big one that, that we've been doing a lot of work on is our training ranges. Um, you know, you think about these bases, they're very, they're very large uh, areas that they cover. And as you're running training exercises, uh, for a commander to be able to monitor that training exercise is a huge benefit. That's tough to do today. When often they don't have very good comms. You know, they got maybe LMR covering things. So you have sort of walkie talkies. Uh, with 5G technology, we have the ability to completely cover the training range uh, for monitoring the training activities. Um, we can, you know, do things like connect drone swarms and, and different types of activities, new uh, TTPs that didn't exist before that you can then take even into the battlefield. Uh, so that's one area that, that we've actually been working on for quite a while. Um, another one, and I'm not going to talk about this one because I think Chris will probably talk about it, but but getting onto ships um, that was mentioned earlier is another area that we've been focused on that we think is super valuable. 